haven't blogged. Wow, blog, blog, good blog, blog, blog. I haven't vlogged in so long, and it's really because I couldn't think of what I wanted to vlog, but then I realized that I go to a lot of art shows that I don't really talk about, and they don't get a lot of exposure. So I was like, yo, this could totally be a thing. So I'm gonna take you to an art exhibition, art gallery opening. Um, well, actually, today's not the opening, crap, but it's like the opening week. Today's Sunday, it opened on Friday, so it's actually pretty big, pretty new, a lot of hype right now. And DC is like low-key popping with the art shows and art galleries, so this is gonna be really interesting for you guys to see, because uh, there's a lot of stuff happening out here, and no one's really telling people or documenting it on YouTube, to my knowledge, so here I am. I am the Kofi. I am the unknown vlogs for your DC art adventure. So guys, we are going to go down to Georgetown on the bike, which is why I'm wearing, or on my bike, which is why I'm wearing this, so I can bike down there and not break a fat sweat. And when we get down there, we'll change our shirt to look a little more acceptable for a gallery setting. All right, made it. Walked a little bit down the way so I could take off my shirt and get prepared for uh, to walk in. I think they're doing like artist talks or something. I don't know, I'm not too interested in that. Um, hope that doesn't mean we have to be quiet and stuff. So let me change the shirt, look a little more presentable and I'll wipe off some of the sweat. <laughs> Jesus, I'm still sweating like a freaking pedophile in Toys R Us there. God damn. I may have worn these shorts yesterday and I got a stain, just noticed it. God damn it. So something else I want to point out is that photography, which just struggles to be a fine art for a lot of people, it's normally priced a lot lower than um, any other fine art is. So for example, this big photo is priced at $750. Not bad. I take that for my photos, but it's still like a very undervalued art form, I think, as far as all the art forms go. It is uh, outfits that would fit best with the, um, with the color itself. So I wanted... All right, so somehow Nina roped me into recording Tay's uh, artist talk. Here's his beautiful work. Super sick. We needed a good videographer, and you were here, so. I'm, I'm, I'm a good, you know, standing, holding Just dummy. Yeah, but I gotta say, I do love that you put the Instagram app on the tags, because some people probably come in here, but they see it and they don't think about it. This, is, this is what we're trying to do. It's bigger than us, it's bigger than this space. This is supporting artists who are making actual work in DC. So if you can't come down here, you can find out about who's making work online. If you do come down here and this piece isn't exactly what you want, but you love his style, find out more about what he's doing. Mm. Support the artists. We're just facilitating for a little while, so keep supporting. That's awesome, gotta support local. Mm -hmm. Super sick. Hey, and congrats, you're like, you're 19? Uh, 19 turning, I'm not turning 19 July. Dang. You're still 18? I didn't even know that. So I'm technically the youngest one. He's 18. I had no idea. What? Wait, so is this is this your first time uh, uh, showing it? Exhibition. Dude, congrats, man. Yay. Awesome, dude. Hope you sell it and get that guap, dude. Yeah. You could buy those shoes for real. Yeah. Or, right. hey, that's true, too. <laughs> Always an artist. Sweet. But yeah, this is Nina. I don't know if I mentioned her before. She's an art badass in the area. And yeah, you know, art yeah. badass. Yeah. Awesome subscriber. Matching so. people in art all day, every day. Mm hmm. Even mm -hmm. Twizzlers and Skittles. This is Kay's favorite piece right here. Dude, that is nuts. I don't even know how you do that. Yeah, his book is actually right here. Oh, oh it's like uh, the Scott. Scott uh, Hutchison. That's the artist that made this piece. 
And his book is right over here. A bunch of cool. Yeah. His style is yeah. like really, oh, really whoa. cool. Oh, whoa. Yeah. Jeez, how big did this guy get? Holy crap. <laughs> his work is really amazing. I, I, I want to do something similar, like have like a book and paint on different materials. This is like cool. inspiration for photography too. It's crazy. Yeah. Very realistic and abstract at the same time. You guys gotta check this out. Well, I shouldn't touch it, but I'm gonna touch it. Oh, oh it's so cool. It's like, it's like dipping dots, dude. That's crazy. I didn't know Kavanaugh could make someone want to make art. I know, I know. I told her husband, I said, if she just had anger, keep that news out. <laughs> just, just, just keep Fox on. She'll, she'll make you tons of money. Right, right. But and, it is beautiful. Yeah, and for, for perspective, just yeah. that's how big it is. Yeah. It's freaking huge. It's 10 by 7 each panel. It's bigger than my room. You also said that oh, wow. some of these paper pieces came out of she, she and her husband are um, remodeling. So some of that came coming right out of their house. Wow. Like this came off the wall in their house. And so she's wanting to leave a bit of the past there too. Jesus. That's beautiful. Yeah, Let's see who did that. Sarah Black Seven. She also did the new finger on the wood in the back. This looks crazy, right? It's like a photo. It's not. That is hand drawn, dude. Nice meeting you. Alright. Yeah, this is Michelle by the way. I didn't introduce her. Super That's okay. cool. We talked about Photography and how it is not valued enough. It is. And all you photographers out there, get shooting. Oh, where did that accent come from? He's got a country accent. I know. Yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Michelle. Hi. Nice Bye. meeting nice you. Nice meeting you. All right, and real quick before I go, I found the most expensive piece. It is this. This is a fountain thing for $22,000. Low price of 22 k Low price of your mama's car. So besides photography, art, um, I really love fashion because fashion photography is like kind of what I do. It's what I love to do. So don't be surprised if you see a lot of that on this channel. It won't be so street or hype beast, just kind of stuff that I'm into, whatever that might be. But um, look, at, look at that Kendra Scott ad. I wish I took that photo. Why don't they pay me $1,000 to take that photo? You know why? It's because you don't know the right person. That's what I figured out. So I'm trying to meet the right people. Where are you at, dog? Hook me up. All right. So, I'm gonna go sit by the water and starve a little bit, and I'm just gonna try and save money for when I get home. Oh, look what I found. It's the same people from the art gallery we were just at. What? What's going on here? This is by the people's International Arts and Dialogue Festival happening right here in DC for the next week. And so right now we have this work by Four Freedoms, I'm talking about basically like what does freedom mean to the everyday person um, and we're encouraging people to let us know what is freedom to them, what is freedom to do something, freedom of, freedom from, um, giving us their ideas. So I can write on this? You can start with you. Okay, I'm going to give it a try. Alright, sounds good. I got to say I think my uh, sign is top five freaking orgasmic life changing thoughts. Alright, I'm going to put it in the ground and then you're going to see it. I don't know. Looks pretty good to me. <laughs> Holy crap. Remember, remember when I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna eat at home and save money? Well, that made the bike home <laughs> so hard. I didn't have any water, which I didn't think about, and I had an empty stomach, so like the two mile bike ride home sucked so bad. It, it literally sucked so bad. So when I got here, I literally forgot to vlog and I just like satisfied my basic needs for survival and I just like rushed to get water and made a plate of food and just chilled for like 30 minutes. So <laughs> here I am, took a shower, feeling a whole lot better. But anyways guys, uh, hope you enjoyed today's vlog adventure on That's the Angle. You know, That's the Angle, it's, it's, it was called Bruce Allen but now it's That's the Angle because I'm trying to do something a little different but uh, today's adventure was a little more dull than I think most art gallery receptions are. This wasn't a reception because receptions are like the opening day and uh, those are the most lit days. They're like a party and 
that's usually what I go to. I, but but this gallery, I don't know if I missed it or it didn't happen or what. But for the most part, um, I'm gonna keep making these. I go to at least one art thing a week, so that'd be cool. Uh, maybe that's like one art party a week, or maybe more, or maybe one every other week. I don't know, but I like vlogging, and if I can show more of DC culture and art life, then I am going to do that. So guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed this kind of content, let me know somehow. DM, like, subscribe, comment, whatever. I don't care. Goals to the podcast, that means a whole lot more. So anyways, guys, um, peace out. Yes.